Are you serious? Oh my goodness. Are you are you are you are you kidding me, man? You you got this this is this is getting out of hand, man. This this is getting out of hand, bro. Man, that that's that, that's that's just as bad awful. as bad as you could possibly imagine. That that is that is awful, horrible. Whatever other words you can come up that are synonyms with those is what that was. Now that I'm in LA, I can't have my first show on the West Coast and not talk about LeBron James and the Lakers. After that flop on Friday night versus the Grizzlies, LeBron James was warned by the NBA on Saturday, meaning another violation would result in a fine. This has led to some questioning whether some of LeBron's flopping will overshadow his greatness so far this season. I'll be the judge of that in the queue. Let's take a look at this here. This is LeBron Friday night against the Grizzlies. Right there, he's posted on the block. Fronted by Dylan Brooks. Goes down. Now, that's a flag. That's, that, that's horrible acting, by the way. You're being this close. You're in Tinseltown. That's a horrible acting performance. But then again, it worked. And you see Dylan Brooks, Dylan Brooks calling him a flopper. Now, you're King James, averaging 25, 8, and 8. Clearly recognized the greatest player in the world and a reigning defending champion. When a young buck like Dylan Brooks is calling you a flopper, that's kind of embarrassing, LeBron. He has a point there. But here's where the point goes out the window. Against the Denver Nuggets. Look at him yamming down the middle. Draw the ball into the lane. No flopping there. Matter of fact, I saw a cast moving out the way. At age 36 in his 18th season, you see what LeBron James can do. So let's not condemn him totally. Here's another case against him here, however. Look at this right here. All right there. Gets caught by the Greek freak Giannis Antetokounmpo. LeBron is holding his face right there. Acting like he got hit in the mouth. That's not true. But I will say this. That wasn't that egregious. I mean, you're trying to sell a call right there. I mean, that wasn't as bad as the one against Memphis. I think people are being a little bit too cruel to King James in that particular situation. Plenty of dudes go up, get their shot blocked, and then they feign like they got fouled. It happens. It's not a crime. Marquee. This certainly ain't a crime. Look at LeBron right here against Houston a few weeks ago. Turn around. Look at I mean, no look. Turn around after a bet with Dennis Schrader. Turn around. Look at his teammates before the ball went in. Having the Lakers bench go crazy. No wonder James Harden ran out of Houston. After that place, they get me the hell up out of H-Town. Can't make a case against LeBron right there. Can't knock that. Here's another flop against him. But this was against LeBron right here. Look at this. Now look, Blake Griffin, you would think once upon a time you would have faced Lob City. And now here you are making news for flopping. So Blake Griffin has gone from hops to flops. But we point the finger at LeBron James. Something's wrong with that picture. Something's wrong with that picture. LeBron was a victim there. Maybe that incentivized LeBron to engage in even more flopping. Maybe if people weren't out there flopping against LeBron James, he would not have taken on their bad habits and start flopping himself. Here's the difference though, LeBron, as a reigning defending champion, as one of the all-time greats, top two all-time as far as I'm concerned. This is a point, LeBron. At the end of the day, you're supposed to set the example, not follow bad examples, especially when you're residing in Tinseltown. If you're going to flop, bro, you got to put forth a better acting job so even the cameras don't catch you unless you want them to catch you. That's acting. That's acting. And that's me in the queue. The case involving LeBron James. I'd say he's guilty. But no jail time. Just a little fine. And he can get on out here. It's about right. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.